are some people they don't have that heart and sometimes i approach some ladies ask them to like for me to be their friends they they just deny me that that's access just to be your friend and they'll tell you no i mean no interested. interested straight up the person will just go straight to the point tell you that i'm not interested but what can you know, i came here and i saw everything that they were saying about the school of what it's wow, wow, so many that you like everything about the oh, school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, and and, and, and uh, 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 it keeps me motivated. And secondly, to it has it has made me let it out. So thank you so much for making time. I'm village boy. Anytime, anywhere you see me, just feel free call me village boy, and I will gladly respond. All right. So today, I have one biggest tycoon here in the building. Yeah. So we are here to engage him to get to know how he started. Right. I know you will enjoy this conversation. It's going to be short, but it's going to be more and more insightful. So stick and stay, don't go anywhere. The name is always Village Boy. If you have not subscribed, kindly subscribe. All right, so without much ado, let's welcome my guest. He's a tycoon, right? All right, so you're welcome to Village Boy YouTube channel. Uh, this is the first time appearing on Village Boy YouTube channel. Okay, so I appreciate, I appreciate your time, man. Dude, you're too good for my liking, right? Okay, so now tell us who you are. Then we take it from there. All right. So I'm 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 your honest. I'm Nyaguluma Onyo, a final year student of University of Cape Coast. Okay. Offering BSc Information Technology. Uh, I think that 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 would be okay for now. That's so brief, right? Are you married? No, I'm saying. I'm saying. <laughs> okay, so that's nice. Okay, so today we are engaging you to get to know you are a tycoon. Or is it like someone who has knowledge in business, you deal in cars and those kind of stuff? Alright, so how did you get started? Even before you came to the university or I think okay, it happened before you came to the university or yeah. after you came to the university before all these things like the business or dealing in cars you came to the research. Well, I think it, it, it all started from uh, level two hundred. Okay. Uh, when we went on vacation. And I met this this man on uh, I think Snapchat. His name is Sam Baron. Shout out to Sam uh, Sam Baron. Okay. Uh, you know he, you know him before, or you just no, met him on Snapchat? I, I didn't know him. I, I knew him through somebody. Who? Yeah. I see. And the the person I I, I, I met him for meeting Sam Baron was uh, Nana Nana G. He's he's in Somalia. Wow. Yeah. From my hometown, I see that. <laughs> I I think I have one free car. For sure. For sure. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> so I think from from then I met Sam Baron and he introduced me to his business. I was like, okay, fine, I'm interested. So he briefed me on how he started and where he is up to now and the, the kind of level he is. So I was like, okay, fine, why not? I have to try. Okay. So we started communicating, and anytime I find a deal and I think that the deal is good, I communicate with him. I tell him maybe I found this person and he wants to purchase a car. We, 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 we drive to the person, we provide the necessary documents, then you take, it, you take it from there? Yeah. Oh, I see. So what kind of car, cars do you deal in? Oh, any, 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 cars. any form of car, whether SUV, saloon cars, any. Me, I love Benzo. I think you will take and, one dash And And, and it, it costs, it costs. <laughs> very, very well. I want to buy Benzo and send it to Akuma Zuiti. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the, the, the rough fruit will, will worry you. You sure? sure. Well, ben, Benz is nice, so I really like it. It's one of my, oh, yeah, yeah, my yeah, favorite. Yeah, yeah. Even though I don't have money uh, yet, but I think but, in future yeah, I will get it. It's, it's, it's one of those nice cars. Okay, so I think that's beautiful. You are students and you are dealing in those kind of stuff. And you told us how you met your business partner on Snapchat. That is the power, power of the internet. Yeah. It means that when we use the internet wisely, it's going to help us. It's going to be in our favor, yeah. right? Okay, so now. Tell us, um, when it comes to doing business in Ghana, it's, some, it's, it's a kind of hectic, very difficult. I mean, how are you managing it? How are you blending it with your academics here and there? Mm. IT students, you do a lot of stuff. You are doing this. How are you blending it? Tell us. Uh, let's... Okay. Thanks, thanks so much. Okay. And, okay. Talk about how I blend my studies with my business. I make sure I, I schedule my time very well and make sure it doesn't uh, conflict with my, my studies. Okay. Uh, and the ch challenges I'm facing right now is uh, uh, how to find uh, uh, good customers and better deal. Okay. Because, uh, the start
starting was, was, a great, was a great one, but as, as, compared, as compared to now and the crisis going on in the country, it's making mm. everything worse. So I think for now, those are the, the challenges I'm facing. Okay, okay, I see that. So um, now tell us, uh, when you started and now currently we, we are asking of how, your money, how you are coping with the economy because there is so um, inflation here and there. I'm very much sure that it's affecting the prices of the cars as well. And you not being able to get uh, good deals like from customers and others. What is your next step? Are you, what are some of the uh, things to put in place or measures to put in place to ensure that at least you have some kind of good customers to come and purchase your car. Okay. Well, for now, for now, what we are doing is if we, uh, I have a boss okay. that controls everything, which I'm helping him push everything to the top. And he's, he's doing so well to bring more customers on board. So what, what we are doing right now is we, we are not thinking too much about our, our profit. Okay. We are making the prices very affordable so that everyone can purchase for now I see. To, to stabilize the, the the business not to make things worse for us because if you keep increasing because things are, are being increased right now you keep on increasing yeah. yours too mm. you are going to lose so oh. we've, we've used everything to its normal state to make uh, the purchasing you know, affordable, affordable, for, affordable everyone. for everyone that's what beautiful. we are doing now beautiful beautiful i love that so now we are switching the conversation to Another topic that is, you know, the main focus of this channel is to advocate for our villages, and uh, you are one of the best. You are one of them that you okay. really uh, like what I'm actually doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so yeah. let's let's talk about it. What is your take on that? Like, okay. yes, what, what is your take on, on, on this issue? Uh, yeah. Do you see any positive yeah. outcome? Yeah. You know, coming out of what I'm currently yeah. doing. Video, and like I'm video. Do you see any positive, like yeah. the um, good future? For our villages, Maybe like, yeah. Are you seeing it? Well, thanks very much for that for that yeah. question. And I really see a very oh, good come. things coming. Come I see come. good things coming because it 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 it's hard for some people to tell us where they even come from. Their villages mm. it's very hard. But you are proud doing what you are doing to make sure oh, come. villages have been promoted and developed. Okay. And. Come, uh, come. My village, uh, let, me, let me set an example. My, okay, village, my village like this. Mm. Um, I don't even remember the last I'm time waiting. I went there too, but the, the leaders and the elders there are making sure improve, improvements and developments are being done or, 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 or okay. put in place there okay. to make sure people don't suffer things like uh, electricity, clinics, uh, mm. uh, Portable, Portable water, water, water electric, uh, telecommunication telecom network. Everything is being okay. done like perfect over there. So I think since you you, you you are using your channel to create such such a thing, I think it is it is mm. a, a very a very great decision that you can make, and it's going to help the villages because there are a lot of people there who are suffering, and they, 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 they make a lot of complaints to the government to make sure things will be done properly okay. over there. But so there are no help. So I think you broadcasting everything on your YouTube channel is going to help. And people who are who are hidden and not seeing anything about your village will, will come to your aid and help you. Okay, okay, thank you so much. And again, another question is that, you know, most people don't want to be attributed to the fact that they are coming from a village. Like they don't want to hear the name village. Yeah. When you address them by, let's say the name village, village girl or village boy like myself, they get annoyed or frustrated yeah. what what brings about all this like how, how what 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 is their perception so far about village like do you have any idea on that uh, you know <laughs> it it's because of the advancement of uh, technology okay because imagine the person was in, in a village and they flipped there for a while now maybe two or three years or uh, probably four years mm. He has been, he or she has been to the city and experienced the, the city life. So definitely, if he or she is being addressed by a village boy or a village or something, okay, he probably or she will probably be annoyed. Because <laughs> <laughs> how 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 can how can you approach me as a village boy? Or a village I mean, the person has been staying in a city for a while, for a while and you meet yeah. a person, you you know, village girl. Yeah. So the so person will also some, think that some, well. some 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 even see their their colleagues who are in the villages as animals. Sorry to see, but uh, that's not how it's supposed to be. We are. It is. It is part of Ghana, and 
if uh, uh, adv uh, technology or uh, advancement of technology has reached your, your end doesn't mean they are animals. Exactly. exactly. As time goes on, they will, they will be seen and probably all those stuff will be done to them too. Because there are a lot of places currently that, that just uh, got electricity in their, in their cities, or let me say the, the, the villages, mm. because it, it is Hello. an extension. Yeah, so exactly. It will get to a point, oh, everybody oh, is oh, going oh. to get mm. that electricity. So you, you getting that first you doesn't mean you, you found the game. I you see. Your, I see. You so you that you've been in, living in a city for a uh, long time now, what which, are some of the things you would encourage you? those from the villages to do so that which they also go apart, even though they are from the village, but they will be apart no. with those Come. who are living in the woman cities? Woman. Like, what are some of the things? Because I'm very much sure that people use so. the kind of attitude or what they see no, um, okay, what Nina. they see about those coming from the villages and that's how they no, how can they address them in a in a in a certain way. What are some of the things you think those from the villages can do? You I, I hope you are getting me. They can do to go up like be a part with those living in the cities. Those highlight on some of them and let's let's make progress. Um, okay. What, what what I think those live who live in the villages will do to be, be, be one of those guys who live in the city, like to uh, just to be like I'm, I'm, I'm trying to compare myself to okay. someone who lives in the city. One, one thing I'll, I'll say is you shouldn't look down on yourself that uh, uh, if you are a bit too crassy, mm, uh, I'm living kind of in the place, so <laughs> I'm, I'm, not, I'm not this person's uh, or something. No, okay, be proud of yourself and be like I'm a human being. Mm. If, if I live in the, in the village, it doesn't mean. Uh, uh, I'm not part of humans or I've been neglected and being in the village means you are nothing. No. We, so, some of these food stuffs and stuff that come from, that we, we, we are using currently, most of them come from the villages. Yeah, from the villages. And the villages have the best farmers. Mm, exactly. That's what exactly. I For the best farmers. Yeah. Jill too. <laughs> <laughs> the villages have the, the best farmers and they are producing more goods than the people exactly. currently living in the because most of the lands are being sold for people to build properties and stuff on. Oh, nice. But the villages, the, 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 the lands are still fertile. Exactly. They are producing better product for us. Exactly. That's what we are enjoying. So we shouldn't look down on them. Exactly. They're all part of us. Beautiful. Let me engage my viewers, then I'll come back to you. All right, so thank you so much, viewers. You know, I really like you. I love you so much for making it to this point. You know something? One favor I ask from you is to subscribe share the video all right that's that is the way you can also support in your capacity right so let's make progress we are engaging the tycoon in all diverse areas all right from business his take on villages and the things that uh, you know if you're coming from a village what you're supposed to do all right so that you be a part with the people living in the cities on a more serious note i want to be candid with you the thing is if you're coming from the villages you lack a whole lot of stuff all right you're handicapped so what i would say is that you have to learn each and every time. Let's hear from him. What do you think? All right. So is it because of dressing that people look at those coming from the village like they, they look down upon them? Advice, advice those coming from the villages. I just want to hear so that I also I mean, learn something from it. Right? I would just say mm. dressing is part of the It's not part? No, 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 no. Really? Okay. Is not part. Yeah, please. Okay. So I wouldn't say Dressing is part mm. because you, you in the city or the people living in the city, you have uh, better jobs doing and okay. uh, proper shelter, uh, good accommodation. So I wouldn't say dressing is part because, like, they, they have they have good road networks and stuff. That's making things very less better uh, for them. Better for them. But those in the villages, they are they are struggling a lot to make it better for themselves so I wouldn't think this in this part but, but but the thing is this those from the cities they they specifically have something that they use it against those coming from the villages that's what I want to know because at the end of the day if someone is looking down upon you it's because of something right so those kind of stuff I want you to tell us so that those from the villages they also be up like we, we all want to uh, challenge yeah. is it happy okay uh, I would say it's, it's, it's the, uh, the mentality. It's the mentality? The mentality. Because 
like the advancement in the country didn't come at once. Mm -hmm. It started from some places. It's a gradual before, process. Yeah, it's a, it's a, a gradual pro uh, process. It didn't, uh, it didn't start from mm -hmm. one, part, uh, one particular place. It, just, it, it was a process okay. that, that everything went through. So I wouldn't say because you are in a city and everything is okay for you. If you look mm -hmm. down on someone in the village. Because if, if they should have uh, potable water, uh, electricity, telecommunication, uh, telecommunication network, Linux, and, and those necessary. I wouldn't think they will need anybody's help. Of course, they have they have good food, food stuff there, mm -hmm. and they will be living all right than those living even less. I you see. Understand? Because everything everything about them will be natural. Mm -hmm. They wouldn't be suffering from anything. But because you are in the city, you think everything is okay because you have better clinics and stuff. So what I, what I would say is, if you are in the city and you think you have much, so much or enough that you think you can, you, you want to give it out or give it out, do some charity and stuff, why not go to the villages? Because as for me, I sometimes get frustrated, you know, people talking ill about our villages, mm -hmm. you know. Myself, people look down for me, but I don't care. You know, I'm kind of, you know, then because my mentality and my mindset is tuned in a way that even when you look down for me, I know who I am sure. and I know where I'm going, actually. Sure. But some people, they don't have that heart. And sometimes I approach some ladies, ask them to, like, for me to be their friends. They, they just deny me that, that access, just to be your friend. Okay. And they'll tell you, no, I'm not interested. interested. Straight up, the person will just go straight to the point. Tell you that I'm not interested. All right, so that kind of thing is some, some kind of, it's, it's like so discouraging, all right? Because if you're from a village like myself, no electricity, no portable water, no telecommunication network, you see, we are in the dark. I would say that we are in the dark. And so when things are happening that way, it doesn't go well with people from the villages. And, you know, some people, they don't have the heart, like I said, all right? And so, because I'm not getting the answer you are trying to give to um, my question, that is, because I said that when people would, I mean, do something against you, they have something they are, I mean, standing on. Is that when a blind man wants to throw a stone at you, the stone is already as well in his palm. <laughs> I just want to know those things. Probably maybe because of the dressing, maybe because of the walking, maybe because of how we vibe, how we talk, those kind of stuff. Just, like, I just want to know those things. Because you've been living in a city, you know the vibe. I just want to know the vibe so that when I go to my village, I can show them this is the vibe. You go according to this. I mean, learn, do this, do that. Then we go to the city, no one will look down for you to feel, you know, inferior. Sure. Yeah. Okay. So, firstly, what I, I would like to talk about is uh, so, uh, those, those, those in the city have some mentality that they are, they are at a level where you can't compare yourself to them. Mm. And secondly, to uh, your, 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 your kind of uh, communication, how you speak. Okay. It, it's also part. And, and moreover, uh, a educational background too. Educational it's, background. It's part of it. Educational background. Okay. Part of it. Okay. So the kind of let, let me pick this uh, this from what you said. The kind of how you communicate. Yeah, how you communicate. How do you notice or how do you uh, I mean get to know that this person what you are saying this guy must be coming from a village, right? Okay. Well, How do you know from the communication? Uh, 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 an, an example I would like to use is Azumi, we are talking about uh, Elon Musk. Mm. We are talking about Elon Musk <laughs> okay. right now as, as a, a, a topic for discussion. Okay. And someone just, I don't know, I don't know, but I wouldn't say a villager, mm. but just uh, uh, anonymous person just come and be like, uh, Mm. Give me to uh, me. Who is Elon Musk? Mm. You'll be like, ah, why? Where, where is this guy coming from? Because he's, he's all over the place. Mm. Elon Musk is all over the place. Huh? Everybody knows Elon Musk. Yeah. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. So, so the, 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 the kind of uh, action the person will put up will let you see that no, this, this person, where is he from? You understand the whole thing? So, meaning uh, that the person, he doesn't yes, have any the person is not. Actually, current, like you know, with the current, current affairs, those sure, kind of. Sure. Understand. understand. With I think that when I go to the village, I need to like carry yeah, the yeah. yeah. I think in one of my videos, I emphasize on the mm. father, uh, emphasize on 
the, ah. the, the aspect of, you know, yeah, to be able to go apart with those in a certain few months, be reading all the time, I mean, so, feed your knowledge with a lot of information yeah. all the time, so that at least when you meet those in the cities, you can easily communicate, I mean, the current and those kind of stuff. All right, so now we are about to wrap up this conversation. And uh, <laughs> the last question to ask is that, what motivates you to come to UCC? <laughs> mm, okay. Uh, I actually bought three forms. You bought three forms? I bought uh, tech. I bought uh, UCC. I bought Legon too. Mm. And uh, I actually didn't like UCC. <laughs> yeah, I, didn't, I didn't like it at all because the kind of news and... Uh, okay, okay. So you tell us why you didn't like it. I, I don't know, but people, <laughs> <laughs> the, the people that came the, the, the past students that came here before S two days a lot. Mm. Even even before I even bought the, the forms, whilst I was in uh, SHS, the kind of stuff I was hearing, they, they, they were like they go to prep and stuff. I was like, me coming from the SHS, I go to prep and stuff. Why why must I go to prep? Here to the same prep. Yeah, so I was like, no, Charlie, we didn't just couldn't rock up. So, but I bought I bought you see, I bought tech, I bought I bought like two. And what gave you admission? They all gave me ad admission. And I was like, no, I don't have to go to Lake because I went to Snia in the, in the uh, city, which mm. is Accra. I went to Snia in the Obama camp and forces. Okay. So I was like, no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go back to Accra again because the, the place is very crowded. Okay. So I wouldn't like to go there. Okay. So and, when... and, and, and I'll be going home often. Mm. Doing unnecessary stuff, so I would like to go to somewhere, somewhere far from home. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. So, so I decided to choose between either uh, tech, uh, tech or, or UCC. UCC. Yeah, and it was it, it was very uh, sad. I didn't hear uh, good news when I when I came back from school. That, that was when I was in SHS. Uh, when I came back home, the the person I was thinking I would go and stay with. Which is my uncle, mm. the one after my dad. I could go and stay with mm. to attend the school. Right. Right. Very fortunate, he, he died. Mm. So I couldn't yeah, right. go back. No, one bed so one bed check, so I had to one so sad. One 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 But one I came here and I saw everything that they were saying about the school. Mm. What mm. It is. Wow, it's wow, not wow. It. So many that you like everything about the oh, school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like Beautiful. everything. And, 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 uh, 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 it keeps me motivated and secondly to it has it has made me let a lot because the kind of uh, pressure and uh, pressure in our face wait wait how, how like, uh, the kind of pressure let me let me let me okay, just the pressure. pressure the kind of pressure they put on you wouldn't let you be a weak student at all yeah. it really it really makes you tough in every situation. Okay, yeah. okay. Okay, so now um, I think you have to we have to wrap up this conversation. So your last word so far okay. for Village Boy YouTube channel, then uh, take okay. it from Bye. Before we do that, uh, thank you so much sure. for giving us the audience uh, to interact with you. Sure. Right. I think our audience uh, viewers would okay. enjoy this video. So your last word so far, so, then we wrap up. Thank you, audience, and thank you to Village Boy, the media, and every, every, everybody. What I, what I would say is, we started and we know where we are going so keep on pushing us subscribe to the channel and like the videos too that's what i'll say village boy village boy today we are safe so we are safe <laughs> all right so thank you so much for making time we will meet again in another video sure, sure.